Hey there, it's uh, Jeffrey Douglas, SD Rover, and just want to do a very, very short video on the Gunner Kennel. If you've followed the channel for a while, you know I travel with my Shiba Inu. Her name is Kiki, and, um, and if you've ever seen a Shiba, they're very active dogs. And if you don't keep them in a crate, uh, they're just going to make your life uh, miserable as they're exploring all around the car. Plus, there's a safety issue. I've um, been in several circumstances where I've almost rolled the LR4. And um, these, these crates, while expensive, are very, very good for survival of your pets. And uh, obviously I strap it down to the top platform in the car, right behind the driver's seat. But um, really recommend them. Great, um, great product. Super expensive. The only thing I would say is uh, they are noisy. Uh, the door does rattle quite a bit. A couple times I've actually gone in and put in some, um, some uh, foam insulation to try to cut the noise down. But um, really good. Uh, Kiki loves it. She gets in there and just, uh, just she's got an orthopedic uh, mat in there and she can just sleep and, uh, and she, she really loves to drive and, and go to places. So um, if you're considering something like this, uh, I'll put some links to, um, to Gunner Kennels below. This is not sponsored. Um, I bought this with my own money, so this is my own opinion. Um, I do love it that they are made in America. And um, I've had this probably, Kiki is almost three years old now, and I've had it for three years. And it's held up, it's held up great. So if you have any questions about it, please put them in the comment section below. If you like to see overlanding gear and trips, please consider either liking or subscribing to the channel. And remember, get outside. Well,